Welcome back to TLC Thursday. Um, as you know, it's the holidays, and for some of you, you're jumping for joy, because like me, I love Christmas music. And for some of you, uh, you may be stressed out to the max, because you probably have jobs, you're trying to get all the presents, and you know, during the holiday seasons, as as beautiful as the holiday is, uh, there's a lot of bad food around us and just a lot of pressure to uh, get a lot done, right? Whether you're traveling, buying presents, and trying to focus on your health, and then we have New Year's coming. Don't even, we won't even get into that. But really what I wanted to do is, uh, this whole month I wanna focus on the way that we wanna feel. Um, and it's great to start getting into our goals in the New Year's, right? We all have goals, but I really want us to have uh, at least three tools to keep us healthy, uh, both mentally and physically, throughout the holidays. So here we go. I'm going to give you three tips to stay your fit <laughs> throughout the holidays. Get a pen and paper. One of the goals that I hear, um, you know, in the, in the beginning of the year for New Year's is for us to either get healthier, get more fit, um, you know, focus on our diets and nutrition. And the thing is, is why should we focus on that in the beginning of the year? The holiday time is, the, that's, the, that's the most time that we're unhealthy, right? We're eating so much and a lot of cake and pies and, uh, and yeah, this is why it's my favorite time of the year. But here's the thing. We don't need to get consumed in diet, right? We wanna have a good time, um, especially when we're hanging out with our family and friends. Um, but we do wanna make sure that we're giving our body what it needs and maybe help it on the way so that we're able to filter out all the bad food and we can start the year fresh. So number one with um, becoming healthy and uh, mentally and physically, number one thing that would help you is drink water. Drink lemon water to alkalize your body, especially in the morning when you first wake up. It's not a big, it's not, a, everybody thinks that being healthy is, is so hard and so expensive, but yet, I mean, water, we all got that, I, I hope. And uh, it's so simple, wake up, drink your lemon water, alkalize your body because it manages your pH level. And a lot of our emotions are attached to um, things that are happening in our body. So if we're, if we're feeling cranky and you know de dehydrated, uh, yeah, it's because we're not drinking enough water. So this is a perfect time to get into that practice before the new year. Number two, move your body. As I said, the holidays is a beautiful time for a lot of us, but we still feel stressed, right? We still have a lot of shopping to do, and if you have a Mexican family like I do, there's about 75 people in the family that you gotta shop for. But it gets stressful, right? And 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 I'll get into more about why we, we get stressed when we're going shopping for people in our lives um, in the next coming week, but it gets stressful and all those emotions get trapped in the body of you know work, trips, presents, finding time to get everyone together. And so moving your body releases those emotions. So whether it's dancing, whether it's getting out there and taking a walk, running, yoga, whatever it is, get your body moving so that you can start releasing those emotions and, uh, and then it'll prepare you for the next week when I talk about why we're actually buying presents and how that stresses us out. Number three, focus on what you want to feel. Again, I'm so excited for this month because we've done the surveys, right? You guys have taken my survey and I thank you all and there's gonna be a lot of things that are coming up in the next year. Um, but this whole month, I really want us to get into the practice of focusing on the things we wanna feel most. Because the thing is, is that we're, we're gonna be trying to align all of our goals, which I don't really like that word, but we'll get into that a little bit later. But when we align ourselves with the things we like to feel most of, we start doing things that, that make us feel those ways, you know? So the reason why we get stressed out during this time is because we're so fixated on things that we need to be doing, even though again, it's a beautiful holiday, 
but we're so fixated on things that we need to be doing instead of the things that we really want to feel. And the holidays are supposed to make you feel good, but I see everybody walking around all crazy balls. And so I truly believe we need to get back into the things that we want to feel. How do you want to feel this holiday? What does spending time with your family do for you? Get into that and focus on that instead, not everything that you have to do. So with these three tips, I think it's going to get us into that, that, that um, in, in our bodies, it's going to allow us to really, really hone in on the things that are important this holiday season. And it's gonna allow us, our bodies, to also be a little bit healthier when we're going into the new year. I mean, why do we need to start being healthy in January when we can start that now? So number one, again, drink your water. Number two, move your body. And number three, get into what you wanna feel. And then focus on that because next week we're gonna go a little bit deeper with this. Does that sound good with you? All right, I'll see you next week for TLC Thursday. If you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, go and do that and check out theladiescoach.com. I love you all and I'll see you next week. Mwah.